Oh, Mr. and Mrs. America, and all the ships at sea, and all you families out there who like to know the truth about America. Welcome to another edition of Propaganda Buses. Today being February 7th, the year of our Lord, 2007 AD. Hi! <laughs> well, I say welcome so you can learn the truth about America. Well, in part, we're really going to learn the truth about the United Kingdom and Saudi Arabia. In the uh, Herald, a British newspaper, there was an article about an American lady who goes to Saudi Arabia on business. She's in the office with another gentleman and the electricity goes out. So they go to a Starbucks which is nearby and they sit in the family section where men and women are allowed to mix. And while they're in the family section, the religious police in Saudi Arabia come up to her and tell her that, so no, no. So they take her and they into a cab and they take her to jail. And what your judge says to her, <laughs> You were sinful and you're going to go to hell for that. And then they throw her in jail, strip search her, and throw her clothes at her, which they got installed for some reason. But through her husband's political connections, he was able to get a release from jail. And you know what she says? She says, I'm not leaving. <laughs> she says, I'm not leaving Saudi Arabia. Most of us would have put our tails between our legs and hightailed it out of there. But she says, I'm not leaving. I'm staying because I'm not going to make them win. She's going to fight this. Sure no. <laughs> She's going to try to change Saudi society. This one little girl. Now I want you to understand. I'm not giving right or wrong in Saudi society or in their culture. That's their business. It's none of my business sitting comfortably here in America. All right. So this lady said she's going to stay there and fight, but yeah, that makes about as much sense as this. Yay, baby, B E B B I Vicky by B O Bo Vicky by Bo B U Boo Vicky by Bo Boo. <laughs> Let me tell you, young lady, you are not going to change the culture over there or the society. You are not Mahatma Gandhi, who was a native to India, who was fighting for uh, Indian independence. You are not the Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King, who is a native of America and fighting for civil rights in, in, in America. You are a family in that country, so mind your own business or get out. <laughs> I don't understand. You can't go into other countries and tell them how to live their culture, how to live their society. It must come from within. Then, the American Embassy says to her, we're going to file a report. <laughs> They're going to file a report. That'll get him. That makes about as much sense as this. <laughs> a whole lot of sense going on, isn't there? Or nonsense. Well, folks, see ya. Take care. And if you're a fan in another country, please don't try to tell those people how to live, no matter how much you find it revolting or disagree with. See ya, kids. You do, dicky, da, do, do. Hey, 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 hey,